Hey guys, Darren here. Welcome to Mayhem Country Living. Hope you guys are doing well wherever it is that you are. A lot of people had asked me about the firewood that I get uh, that we use because some people were laughing at me cutting up the square logs, as they call them. But this is a railroad tie company here in uh, Montevallo or Alabama. Yeah, Montevallo. And they sell it by the truckload scraps. It's rejects that have not been treated yet. It's all heart hardwood and it is kiln dried and it just doesn't pass their inspection. So you get a truckload for $25. You can get a truckload and a trailer for $25. I mean, it's, it's the same price. They only have a stipulation. You, you come in and you wear, you know, PPE, you sign a waiver, and then you load it yourself and you sign back out when you leave. This is kind of what I do for a living also, so I'm wearing my own personal stuff. And it's pretty dang good. Um, they don't want you to fill it up higher than the sides of your truck and regretfully I always forget to take my box out of the back of the truck. Uh, this is a, a full size uh, F-150 full, full size cab and so it holds a good bit of wood and uh, well you'll see when you get there. Alright guys now we're going through this is a working lumber yard so there's heavy equipment everywhere and uh, You'll see them, uh, they have the, all the hardwood stacked up, unprocessed, and you have to, uh, you know, navigate around all the equipment, all the rail cars and everything. Fortunately, it's close to the house, there you go. And they do a lot. Those are some that are treated, railroad ties. And then they have uh, bridge bracings. Uh, so some of this stuff is really, really long. Some of it's 24 feet. And all this is the heart of the hardwoods. And, you know, nowadays they're sustainably grown, but they still get a lot of uh, pulp waters coming in who bring in, uh, you know, large logs, pieces and parts and everything, and it will blow you away. what they have and like I said you really need to come in and do uh, your safety checks with all the equipment and there's my little zebra on the hood my good luck zebra and it's kind of like going into a rock quarry which I do a lot of them as well you obey the rules of the road and the rules of the road is if it's bigger it goes first we go. now we're coming up on their scrap wood pile i've mentioned before in videos that it's about as long as a football field or two probably two football fields and it's about 60 feet high and here we come up to it And like I said, you don't come out here in your Prius to get a load of wood. No joke, this is about 60 feet high. That's some fresh stuff, so it probably hasn't been rained on as much. That is what we'll pull from. Okay guys, now we're back. So behind me, you can see the piles and piles of this stuff so you come out to a place like this plan on spending an hour loading your truck up the noise you hear they're loading up a rail car full of uh, sawdust so we're coming so there you go this is how we heat our house for the most part. Now, a lot of people are gonna say, oh my gosh, I would just do something, something
something something. Well, yeah, you could. Absolutely. But, how much was your power bill during the cold spell we had? How much was your gas? How much fuel did you burn? This is a good way to do it. $25 for a truck, a truck and a trailer. Can't beat it. More to come. But, again, Alright guys, so we're going to wrap it up with this video. Again, yes, you can just suffer and pay the high costs. And uh, if you don't have a fireplace in your house, I certainly understand this. Um, you want to make some side money? Buy this for $25. Bust it up. Sell it for $150. Do it all day long. Can't beat it. It's a good little side gig. I've thought about doing it. But uh, right now, my main concern is getting enough just to heat our house as uh, to help offset any kind of expenses. Yes, we have central heat in here, absolutely. And we have propane heat and all kinds of stuff. This is a lot cheaper, and uh, you get a good workout. I pay for a gym membership for my wife and myself. I tell you what, this is just about as good because we're going to do a video on busting up this wood. Take care of your people, guys.